Hello everyone, welcome to providing the solution given this nice exponential equation, which is 8 to the power x plus 8 to the power x this is equal to 72. So what is the value of x? Now solution from what we have here, 8 to the power x is common, so we factor out 8 to the power x, and that means that 8 to the power x divided by 8 to the power x is 1 plus 1, this is equal to 72. Okay, now from here we'll have 8 to the power x multiplying by 2, that's 1 plus 1, this is equal to 72. So we divide both signs by 2, so that now we'll have 8 to the power x, this is equal to 36, this is equal to 36. Now to solve for the value of x, we introduce the natural logarithm on both signs as follows. That is rog 8 to the power x. This is equal to rog 36. Now, rog 8 to the power x. This is in the form of rog 8 to the power n, which you can express as n rog rog a. Okay? So this is the power root property of logarithm. So rog 8 to the power x becomes x rog 8. This is equal to rog that six we divide both sides by rock eight by rock eight so let's proceed simplify we'll have rock eight and rock eight simplifies so that x is equal to rock that the six divided by rock eight okay now from what we have here we can express that the six that the 6 can be expressed as 9 multiplied by by 4, all right? And we, we can be able to reduce this further, that 9 can be expressed as 3 to power 2 multiplied by 4, 4 can be expressed as 2 to power 2, okay? In addition, we can express 8 as 2 to power 3. We can express 8 as 2 to power 3. Now, substituting this, x it can be expressed as rog 3 to power 2 multiplied by 2 to power 2 divided by rog 2 to power 3. Now, as you can see, rog 3 to power 2 multiplied by 2 to power 2, this is actually in the form of rog A multiplied by B, which you can express as rog A plus rog B. Now, applying this logarithm identity, will have x is equal to rog 3 to power 2 divided by rog 2 to power 3 2 to power 3 plus rog 2 to power 2 divided by rog 2 to power 3 okay now rog 3 to power 2 okay applying the power root property of logarithm that is rog a to power n. This can be expressed as n rog a. So applying this property, it follows that x is equal to. Now applying this property, applying this property, we'll have x is equal to rog 3 to power 2 becomes 2 rog 3 divided by rog 2 to power 3 becomes 3 rog 2 plus. Now, rock 2 to power 2 becomes 2, rock 2. And rock 2 to power 3 becomes again 3, rock 2. Now, let's simplify here. Let's proceed and simplify. X is equal to, now here we'll have 2 over 3, rock 3, divided by rock 2. Plus, now here rock 2 and rock 2 simplifies, so that we'll have 2 over 3 will have only 2 over 3, okay? Now, rog 3 divided by rog 2, this is actually in the form of rog A divided by rog B, which we can express as rog A to base B. Now, let's apply this particular property. Let's apply this property so that x is equal to 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 rog 3 to base 2. 
okay now this is the value of x this is the value of x now let's verify if this value of x actually satisfies the equation okay now let's verify that the value of x which is 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 root 3 to be 2 actually satisfies the equation now if you recall if you recall we end at 8 to power x plus 8 to power x this should give us a value of 72 now we express this as 8 to power x okay this is 1 plus 1 this is equal to 72 and that means that 8 to power x this is equal to 36 okay we simplify into to this form so let's substitute the value of x so that we can check if we'll have a value of 36 now substituting the value of x will have 8 to power 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 rock 3 to base 2 so this should give us a value of 36 let's check if this is true let's check now we can express 8 as 2 to power 3 we can express 8 as 2 to power 3 now we'll have 2 to power 3 into the parentheses 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 rog 3 to be 2 this should give us a value of 36 okay now from what we have here let's simplify here let's simplify so that we'll have 2 to power 2 plus 2 rog 3 to be 2 this should give us a value of 36 okay now 2 to power 2 plus 2 proc 3 to be 2 this is actually in the form of 8 to power n plus m which we can express as 8 to power n multiplying by 8 to power m now applying this indices identity it follows that applying this indices identity applying this identity we'll have 2 to power 2 multiplying by 2 to power 2 rog 3 to base 2 this should give us a value of 36 okay now 2 to power 2 2 to power 2 this is equal to 4 okay 2 to power 2 this is equal to 4 and 2 to power 2 rog 3 to base 2 this can also be expressed this is a power so this can be expressed as we take these two here so that we'll have 2 to power rog 3 to power 2 to base 2 okay and as you can see 2 to power rog 3 squared to base 2 this is in the form of m to power rog a to base m which we can express as a now applying this logarithm property 2 to power that is 2 to power rog 3 squared 3 squared this is 9 to base 2 this should give us a value of 9 okay now from what we have here we have 2 to power 2 which is actually 4 so we'll have 4 multiplying by 2 to power log 9 to base 2 which is 9 this should give us a value of 36 so that means that 4 times 9 this is equal to 36 that means that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side okay and that actually affirms that the value of x the value of x which is 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 log 3 to base 2 actually satisfies the equation so if it is your first time you come across my videos please like and subscribe like and subscribe see you in the next video bye bye